question number one and here we go this is going to be rather an easy nut to crack problem number one and this is for as many as eight marks my art number matlab free ke mil rahe. and we can easily crack this one in less than five minutes you are going to watch why here we go so we have to construct a parabola by the focus directrix method this is also known as the general method okay if the distance of focus from the directrix is 70 millimeters so data is sufficient you won't have any problem as far as the construction is concerned what you need to do is you need to construct a parabola clearly stated in the problem using the focus directrix or the general method so first of all what do you know sir we already know that the distance between the directrix and the focus is 70 millimeters so what you have to start off with is by making this structure done in this structure please make this vertical line which is popularly known as the directrix and secondly if you watch this distance is the distance between a point on the directrix and the focus this has to be taken as 70 millimeters similar it's very simple on this horizontal line you need to make a point over here at a distance of 70 millimeters from c that is your first thing to do and you can then extend this line by 40 or 50 millimeters by the way this line is your default axis axis of the parabola done done sir now in parabola we know very well that eccentricity is equal to one that means distance of any point on the parabola from the focus to the distance of save point from the directrix let's say c okay this always is equal to one you need to find a point between c and f in such a way such that its distance from f is equal to its distance from c so basically we are looking for the midpoint of cf so midpoint can be located very easily you know it is 70 half of 70 35 done now take the construction ahead by marking points at equal intervals of 10 millimeters okay you can take it 15 millimeters also you can take it 5 millimeters also but i would suggest if this is 5 you should take this also as 5 this also is 5 if 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 by the way this has been taken as 10 then the other point has to be marked at a distance of 10 millimeters this is my suggestion okay <laughs> anyway so uh, from starting from this very point at equal intervals of 10 then 10 then 10 i have marked as many as six points and through all of these points i have made vertical lines can you do this only the parabola will be bold and dark or dark and thick okay you can make this axis and directrix also dark no problem whereas these construction lines should be very very light a uh, little grayish in color you can use a 3h or a 4h pencil for that purpose okay now what's up we are going to make use of a compass so with c1 as the radius listen to this with c1 as the radius and now with focus as the center you need to make an arc on this vertical line passing through one above and below simple done now with c2 as the radius and with f as the center and on this vertical line passing through two what you need to do is you need to make another arc p2 and p2 dash in the same fashion now with c3 as the radius with this focus f as the center and on this vertical line passing through three okay make a point of oh, cut an arc above and below p3 and p3 dash in the same fashion you can make the remaining points p4 p5 p6 and when you join all of these points in proper sequence when you join them you get a curve which is popularly known as a parabola it's that simple okay start from this very point and on its way okay keep it touching on the line for the, some distance touching 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 and then divert away right this is how you need to make your parabola and the final drawing should look something like this uh, considering the construction aspect okay please see the difference see the difference done first problem is done in four minutes and 41 42 43 seconds